everybody, and welcome to Recipes for Life. I am Mercedes Wilson, and I am here with Smita. Hi. Hi <laughs> Listen, I am so excited for today's dish because I love the diversity that we have on this feature. And what spices did you use for this dish? So I use the meat spice, which has 12 different spices that I uh, used. Oh my gosh. Plant everything in here except salt. So this is the kale, the chopped greens. So this is the um, green chilies, Thai green chilies. These are very hot. All of them are hot? Yes, so you're going to use either Ooh, one or two. spices, spi oh, just one or two. You're not using them all. No, I'm like, no. Ooh, just, oh, you're, you're brave. So this is the dill, and then this is the coriander or cilantro. Okay, and so then this, I just bought to show it to you what actually curry means in India. Uh, curry is just a leaf, it's not a dish. So these are just nasturtium uh, flowers. Um, they are edible flowers, and we are using them for the garnish. You yeah. don't have to have that. And then the chopped tomatoes. Mm -hmm. uh, then again, I chopped some coriander under here mm -hmm. and some cucumber for eating on the side and then the microgreens that I have these are also uh, cilantro microgreens and this are the pickled onions mm, I love pickled onions and ginger garlic paste okay. and the Thai hot chilies that I chopped okay all right and this um, box is called a spice box all Indian families all the moms <laughs> actually have it and it's a symbol of you know um, you, your house, uh, what what you like to cook. So the spices that you put in here are most of the flavors that you cook with. So mine are the ones that I make, um, meat spice and the veggie spice and the basic other spices. I never used to eat red meat and I did not like uh, my dad eating red meat either because he was a huge fan of it. Mm -hmm. uh, so my, what my mom would do is she was always scared of getting the red meat in the house so she would bring the ground meat, ground lamb mm -hmm. or you know so she would do that and she would call it chicken. And so she would make it after <laughs> school when I would come home hungry um, and she would just have this uh, huge mortar and pestle that we have so she would take the lamb and she will grind it more because it's fresh uh, lamb and then she will grind the spices there and immediately she'll make this because this is quick to put yeah. together and then she will roll it in the flatbreads um, and give it to me and then after I've eaten the whole thing I would ask her is this chicken and she's like <laughs> no nope. yeah, that's chicken yeah. and I was like why the chicken looks like this red color like you know the dark meat gets yeah, yeah, yeah. darker cook it and then she'll be like okay just eat it <laughs> oh my gosh see we all have a story folks we all have a story and that's why i love recipes for life give me a spice that we all need in life smita give me one spice just smita's cookery spices oh she's so good look and she's selling her spices folks go to mercedesewilson.com you'll get more info on her stuff recipes for life you need people like smita in your life folks <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you much so much. And thank you for joining us. You need to try this dish. You need to try this dish. I am. Bye, folks. <laughs>